Fire officials in Lino Lake say they were fortunate to find a used fire truck to replace one that had to be taken out of service because of a structural issue. City Council approved buying a replacement, but it's only a temporary fix. As Mike Johnson explains, they had supply chain challenges to work through. To look at the Lionel Lakes fire truck known as Aerial 11, you can't really tell there's a problem bad enough to keep it parked at the station. The mechanics of the truck, like the engine is still good, the transmission is still good. The paint looks great, it's until you climb underneath it and start looking at the corrosion on the frame. Deputy Public Safety Director Dan Lalier says the rust on the frame was bad enough to take it out of service. It was determined unrepairable, and crews are now removing parts that can be reused. It left the Lionel Lakes Fire Department with a problem. They needed a pumper truck that could also carry water in areas of the city with no hydrants. One option was to buy a new truck. There's not a lot out there with supply chain issues. Um, trucks are um, many, many months out, 24 or greater. Um, so to build a truck, we would be without a truck until that truck would be delivered. And that would be you know, between 24 and 36 months. So they quickly started looking for a used truck that would cost less and be delivered faster. They found this 2004 model in Wisconsin for nearly $182,000. Used trucks are like used cars right now. They're a premium. People are selling them for inflation is crazy. Um, we, were, we were lucky to find the truck and uh, secure that truck. And our council moved quickly to, to purchase it. But it only answers part of the department's problems. This one doesn't carry enough water and they'll rely on two smaller vehicles that are also getting older. We've got a committee together to, to nail down a specification for two new water tender pumpers that will replace our two tenders and then replace this truck that we purchased, this used truck. And they hope to get that done in about three years. For North Metro TV News, I'm Mike Johnson reporting. Deputy Director Lelier told Mike the department had hoped to get more years out of Aerial 11. It also features that tall ladder, but the department does have another truck with a ladder.